and so this weekend I went to Walgreens and had something kind of weird happen. Um, the lady at Walgreens asked me if anybody ever told me that I looked like a stunt double for John Malkovich. Well, no, because you don't. <laughs> what? <laughs> so, I was kind of like, I was kind of offended because who? When does Malkovich ever need a stunt double? That's what offended uh, right, me first. Exactly. Uh, but wow. I was going to talk with her today because we're in October. Well, you do actually a little bit. Yeah. Maybe, maybe a little. I had to pull up a picture, but <laughs> just old bald guys with beards look all look the same. Oh, exactly. I don't know. Um, That's not. But fair. that we, may be racist. I wanted to kind of end the show today, just to like you know, we we get a lot of deep talks, but this could be something. You know, holiday parties are going to be coming up. People are going to do Halloween, and there's always the dilemma oh, for me yeah. that. I only have about three options because I can either be Butterbean, mm -hmm. I can be Uncle Fester, or I can be uh, like an out of shape, stone cold Steve Austin. That's about my only <laughs> option that I can do. I like the latter. So I know, <laughs> so I know we're coming on that. So I, we need to look up, you know, and, and figure out maybe a plus size male Malkovich? Halloween costumes. Oh. Plus size male Halloween. Co We're going to leave that to <laughs> you, the people. Yeah. Um, what should we yeah. dress? Whatever like? you, whatever you want, Mr. Malkovich over here to dress like for <laughs> Halloween. Uh, that hurt it, my feelings when that lady said that. It, it uh, ruined Malkovich me. is a, he's a great actor. Sure. He's a great actor. He's one of my favorite actors. Actually, I love. I mean, I love. He is intense. He like, can be. Yeah. 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 yeah I, I started watching a movie this week uh, called Ava. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I hate it when I do that. God, I hate it when I do that. There's a video playing right now, and it's this Antifa protester like slinging something on a police officer. It looked like gasoline. I mean, it was coming out of a gasoline bottle, and he's slinging it. And this <laughs> this cop just like grabs his baton. It's one of those extendable ones, and he's just like one one thing extends it, and then hits him one time, and dude goes out cold. Good. Um, I mean, and, whoa. What? Uh, I mean, that's, that's so horrible. it just it just caught me. I'm sitting here talking about John Malkovich, and I look up and. And there's a uh, there's a millennial that lives in his mom's basement playing uh, Fortnite all night, getting knocked out by a cop, and then it just made me happy. Uh, I'm sorry about that. Squirrel, uh, 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 overweight Antifa terrorist will not you, be a Halloween costume. No, for me. Exactly. no, we, no, that's off no, the books. No. <laughs> you might be able to. No, I was gonna say, could you do mm -hmm. a Joe Biden? But oh, but no. no, he's. You, I want to have fun. Well, and that that and you don't need a diaper. Um, no. So oh, there's yeah. that. But uh, Copper just gave me crazy looks. Did she? <laughs> yeah. I, I miss the last couple of shows I did with Copper. She was in the other studio, and I was over here. And I miss her looks because she always gives me these crazy looks because I'm crazy. And then she, she and so I've. Oh, I've, Copper, I've, I've, I've I've missed having her. Tomorrow morning. I've okay. missed having her in. Well, she's done it. She did that a couple of times, and she said, "No, nah, I'm good. Like, no, uh, I'm no. good." The early morning thing is not for her. Uh, so, but she she's here because she's going to be with Dale in studio, and so um, she's not on mic right now. But uh, it, uh, don't you love when you talk about someone who can't talk back? Exactly. It's the yes. best. It's the absolute best. But no, we uh, we love we love having having everybody in studio. It's been fun this morning. We we this is kind of the new normal, I guess. Uh, everybody talking about their new normal. So settle in, 2020. Here we come. Uh, I guess 2021, it's almost over. Can you believe Christmas stuff is going out, by the way? Uh, it offends me in the deepest way Halloween, possible. And Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. And we were already decking the halls. Yeah, it, it happens every year, and it gets a <sighs> little bit earlier every single year. Like, it's ridiculous. Before you know it, uh, Hallmark will be playing Christmas movies around. Oh, wait. Aren't they doing that They now? already do. Yeah. I can't they say anything though because I watch do. Elf all the time. You watch Elf out of Christmas season? Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah, we start about September. <laughs> but it's my favorite movie, and it's like well, one it's that my, but me and it's my, my little my, boy that we love to watch. It's he like loves, saying you watch Die Hard outside of Christmas because like, Die Hard's what? a Christmas movie, right? I agree. Thank you. Y'all are one crazy. person in this room got that. Um, Just because they have a. Christmas scene in it in one No, spot. are you serious, Sandy? Do you live under a freaking rock? <laughs> Have you not been around for the last couple years of debate as to whether or not Die Hard is or is not a Christmas I movie? If we just... opened up the phones right now, mm -hmm. we would have more calls on this subject than anything. If we had more than two minutes, I would show that to you because it is unbelievable the level of... Connor, have you seen Die Hard? No. Oh Thank my you, Connor. God. Okay, back Whoa. to mute. You, back to mute. Back to mute. <laughs> um, it is unbelievable. Really? Connor? I'm disappointed. 
You know that I don't watch that many movies. I know you. I know movies. that you live under a rock too, but it, it doesn't mean that you couldn't make an effort to be a better person. Now that you've met me, I, a I'd like. Person. Yes, I would like to. Have, <laughs> yes, a better person Zach. because you're more Sorry, culture. I'm too busy volunteering in the community uh, <laughs> while doing all that good stuff rather than <laughs> sitting at home watching oh. Die Hard. I just got I served you. by a senior in high school, <laughs> um, and that's and that's pretty much been the best part for the course of my life over the last uh, thirty three years. It's okay; it doesn't hurt my feelings at all. I'm unembarrassable. Uh, it really is. It's a it's a gift. It really is. But Die Hard is it a Christmas movie? Maybe we need to take that on tomorrow because yeah. at, well, I knew that was or we'll be. save it for the Christmas season and make it you know bring it back up in November December time frame. But then again, if you ask Walmart, it's already Christmas time because we're decking halls. Mm -hmm. Frosty and, melting and Hans Gruber going face first. They're good Christmas stories. Uh, without question, Hans Gruber going Facebook or Facebook going Facebook, Facebook going face first takes the cake for me. Will Hampson, you have seen Die Hard. There's no doubt about that. Um, is it a Christmas movie? Yes, hundred percent Christmas. Movie. Thank you. I, I thought I'm I'm just glad to know that we have such smart people on the show. Uh, okay, I'm watching it tonight. Thank you. You're welcome, Connor. I I don't think I can make that commitment. <laughs> Why, you know why not, Connor? Come on, Connor. You can do it just this once. Just lower your what? IQ just a little bit. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, you're not hurting my feelings. Bruce Willis has a certain set of skills. He will find you. He will get you. He can. I <laughs> oh, here we go. And that's the female influence on the show. Yeah, hold, um, hold it together. Now this is where you're the reins, right? Yeah, here. no, this is when that what did I tell you earlier in the show? When I'm when I'm holding the reins, we are screwed. 